What we have is two species of cosmic beast. We have the kind of thing that struck Arizona, and we have the kind of thing that struck Siberia. The thing that struck Arizona was a hunk of metal, an iron asteroid. It's about the same density as a piece of cast iron. That thing plunges through the atmosphere, and the atmosphere doesn't break it. It doesn't break until it hits the ground, and then it explodes and digs this hole. The Tunguska object was a chondrite, a, almost certainly, because a chondrite, well, it would be like a lightweight rock. A comet is more like a snowball. Once you get a, a chondrite that's four or five hundred feet in diameter, it can get through the atmosphere and it can hit the ground. But anything less than that, it's going to do a Tunguska. It's going to blow itself up in the air, and it'll, it could knock over forests, it could start fires. If there were buildings underneath, it could decimate those, but it wouldn't leave a crater. So now, in Arizona, 25,000 years later, boom, you walk up to it, it's pretty obvious what it was. Something happened here, something big blew up and left this big hole in the ground, right? 